Today I'm in the 3700 block of Clifton in a duplex down, four bedroom, three bathroom apartment about a half a block north of Wrigley Field. It has two wood burning fireplaces, one on each level. Let me back up and kind of give you a feel of the room. It's a very large entry. That's the living room there. See, it's got a great kitchen, stainless steel appliances, granite countertop. See, tucked in is the under the counter microwave, counter depth, refrigerator, stainless steel, a true chef's stove. See the granite surround, garbage disposal, nice dishwasher. Room right here to the left for a dining room table. Looking out, this is on the east side of the street. This is Clifton that you see in front of us. Very bright, very nice. This is the front door. Recessed lighting. We'll walk back through the place. We'll do the top floor first, first floor. Walk down the stairs. There's a closet to your right. Coming up to the first bathroom. See, first bedroom. You can see it's a very large bedroom. It'll hold a queen size bedroom easy, maybe even a king. See on the far wall over there, you've got great closets. Here's the common bathroom on this level. It's a shower, nice surround shower. The colors on this right now are beige. They're gonna be switching them to gray. The people have just moved out. I wanted to get in and get, good, get a good video of it and pictures. But this is going to be a sort of a dove gray when we do, when we finish. This is the master bedroom. The master bedroom, there's a deck on the back, but you do not have to go through the bedroom to get to that deck. This is the closet, or this is the back door from here. In this room, you have a large walk-in closet. Going into the master, see stone countertops, big double vanities, huge. Over here and also is the steam shower with multiple shower heads. You also have a nice whirlpool tub, big deep garden tub with jets on it. I want to show you one of the really nice features of this place is it comes with one garage parking space included but it also has some great outdoor space. Here's its back deck. You can see with the back deck that there is a uh, gas outlet so if you wanted to help or you wanted to hook up your natural gas to a grill, you could do it. There's lights back here as well as an outlet. Something that's very nice about this is your deck is above the garage. It's a three car garage. So you end up with the uh, really huge space on top, probably about 600 square feet of a, your own patio. One thing, nice thing you'll see about this, if you'll see in the background, you'll see Wrigley Field is there. So concerts and stuff, this will be nice. The landlord does have a, a limit of 20 people on this. He doesn't want too many people up here. Things tend to get messed up at that point. Again, this is looking back down at your patio, your private patio. And again, there is Wrigley Field. From here, we're gonna walk back down through the apartment, go to the lower level where we have another living room, a wet bar, an under counter refrigerator, laundry room, two more bedrooms, and another bathroom, as well as a wood-burning fireplace. Again, all this beige that you see is going to be gray all the way across. Downstairs also has over nine foot ceilings in it. They're in the process. They took carpet out and they're putting uh, a wood grain tile in here right now. Next couple of days when they're finished, I'll get a better, better uh, picture of it. But here's the tile that's going to be done throughout down here. It's a nice porcelain tile. This is your living room down here. You can see that is another wood burning fireplace on that far wall. There's an under counter refrigerator that goes there. It's 
there's a sink, so it's a nice wet bar. And again, down here, the uh, ceilings are like nine foot two inches high. So they're very nice, very big. Even though in your garden, the lower level, you're not gonna feel like it. Here's underneath your stairs, you have some more storage. Going back down this hallway, we're going to the first bedroom. And again, there's just concrete showing right now. They're gonna be putting the tiles all the way through here. And again, down here, they're going to put the gray paint as opposed to the beige that you see. Nice big walk-in closet for this bedroom down here. And this bedroom would accommodate a king-size bed, no problem. From here, we're gonna go into the bathroom that's between the two bedrooms down here. It's nice stone countertop, nice uh, tub and shower combination in the background back there. Very good. From here, you've got the laundry room. Now, downstairs, they have heated floors, which with the tiles is going to make it very, very nice in the wintertime as far as that goes. There you can see the back of that. That's your, uh, your wine fridge or your, your refrigerator that goes underneath the wet bar down here. In the far room back there, you can see there's gas forced heat, central air conditioning, your own hot water heater. In the back, I don't know if you can see it or not, but you've got the control manifolds for the heated floors that run throughout. Again, here's another bedroom. You're also looking at a king size bed fitting in here. It's kind of hard to tell, but again, you've got over nine foot ceilings. This is gonna be very sharp when they finish it with the new tile floor. And again, another really big closet here. This closet runs all the way across this wall. Again, it's uh, on Clifton in the 3700 block. You walk back up to the front. Two fireplaces, garage parking included. Two decks, one of which is over 600 square feet. A chef's kitchen, stainless, stainless steel appliances. 